Look at this. Looks delicious, right? Just like the real thing. An awesome plant-based burger. And look at this. If you put enough seasonings on top, you almost can't see it. And as you know from when you're a kid, if you cover up the food that you don't want to eat, no one will notice. Seriously though guys, we need to stop eating meat. It's not good for the environment and it's not good for us. Think about it. All those cows standing round all day eating grass like it grows on trees. And what do they do besides that? Farting, pooping, peeing. That's it. And that's just the environment. Think how bad it is for our health. We've known for years that red meat will give us colon cancer, stomach cancer, and cancer cancer. Even decades after reducing our red meat consumption, it's still giving us cancer. Meat kills, and it needs to be stopped. Which brings me to the alternative. Plants and food made from plants. And there are multiple benefits to eating a diet of plants and plant products, both for the environment and for us. First of all, you don't need grass. And if there is any, Monsanto will take care of that. Just say the word. Then all you need is just a big spare bit of ground to grow the plants. And if there are trees there, they can be sacrificed for the growing of the plants. Plants, or midget trees as I like to call them. And before you say save the trees, consider this. If the land were being used to graze cattle, surely they would get rid of the trees as well. You think those lazy old cows would put up with having to limbo vertically around the trees? They can barely stand on four legs, let alone two. Anyway, so the plants grow, get harvested, and then more can be grown. Total flexibility. And the plants are not like, I need to eat grass, surround me with grass, otherwise I'm going to die. Grass that needs lots of water, by the way. The plants just happily grow in the dirt. And those plants, once they're harvested, they can be sold as is. Once you wash most of the chemicals off. Or they can be used to make some new food. In a clean, bacteria-free factory. And in that factory, we can optimize the production of food so that it has as little impact as possible on the environment. So would you rather eat meat from a dirty cow that craps where it stands? or meat substitute that's produced in a clean, environmentally friendly factory. And here's the thing, everything that's produced in that factory is ultra tasty and low fat, containing heart healthy ingredients that the American Heart Association endorses. And what endorsement is more convincing than that? Endorse products like canola oil that's had all the bacteria and dirty stuff killed off by washing it in petroleum. And if anything is capable of killing, it's petroleum and petroleum products. So you know it's going to be safe because all that bad bacteria and yucky stuff is killed right out. And that's the thing about plant-based food. It's all top-notch ingredients that have been bleached of anything we don't want. That meat you're eating is just meat. And to all those people that say, why are cancer rates still increasing? Why are cases of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease still increasing? Why are rates of type 2 diabetes and obesity still increasing? I say to the people with those conditions, did you eat any meat? And to those people that say our environment is more polluted than ever, I say to them, have you seen how much crap a cow produces? Guys, thanks for watching. Please don't forget to click like and subscribe. Please consider supporting me by becoming a channel member. Click the join button under this video or the first link in the description. And I'm looking forward to seeing you in the next video. All those cows standing <laughs> All those cows standing around all day eating grass like it grows on trees. We've known for years that red meat will give us colon cancer, stomach cancer and cancer cancer. <laughs> this is stupid. They can barely stand off. <laughs> Or meat substitute. <laughs> I say to them, have you seen how much a cow craps? <laughs> that was wrong.